in MotoGP. Ooh, the They're going to take the eighth. Who's going to become the eighth different winner of 2020? Will it be Rins? Will it be Marquez? Could it got this one covered? Has he beaten? Has he fended off the superb charge of Alex Marquez? Rins, he has a habit of springing a surprise when you least expect it. He did it last year at Silverstone yeah. with Mark Marquez. And now is he going to do it? to land Aragon circuit when you talk about home races home soil well that certainly applies to this young man who's won do you know what he'll only be 30 points I think down in the world championship well, yeah. if he wins this Alex Rins incredible free race another twist in the tail in MotoGP 2020 surely it's Alex 4 and 5 Alex Marquez has been really strong with that medium front tyre there is your new MotoGP world champion leader well, rather surprisingly now then, turn seven. Alex Marquez is starting to run out of time here. Alex Rins has got one about the advantage. Dropping down then, Alex Marquez is just, you know where he's going to try it. Yeah, turn it's, the last couple of corners. It's the only he's place gonna, the corners down there for Alex Marquez. He's got to try and get close enough to get that slipstream on the Suzuki and then try and move up the inside. Time. There's three tenths between Mir and Vinales. There could yet be a twist in the tail for third place. Now Coming then, here out we go. Of the final Who's, turn. It's all about the drop. Patrick Suzuki, has he done enough? Here comes Alex Marquez trying to get every ounce of slipstream. I don't think he's going to be close enough. It's Alex from Alex. A standing victory for Alex Rins here in Aragon. Ahead of Alex Marquez who gets a drive. Fifth place finish for him. More Bedelli sixth and Dovi in seventh. But what a ride from Alex Marquez, the rookie. Back to back on Fabio Quattararo who limps home in 18th place a nightmare Grand Prix here in Aragon for <laughs> with just four races to go get out of jail free Andrea oh, Domizioso no, has managed to close on the with four races to go look at his recent record as well Domizioso fifth seventh eighth DNF for disappointment of that crash while in podium contention while in victory contention in Le Mans last weekend he was the man of the day because that was an astonishing ride 18th to second in the wet in Le Mans huge congratulations to Alex Marquez thumbs up from him what a ride that was within three tenths of a second credit to Alex Rins because he survived some of the most intense pressure he's probably been experienced in his Grand Prix career. In the dry, it's looking pretty bright for Honda all of a sudden, Simon. Yes, Alberto, massive congratulations on amazing ride from Alex. He got the correct motivation and concentration, so the guy is going step by step, but uh, he's... What a ride that was by the rookie. Alex Rins, though, he will take the plaudits, and rightly so, because he rode quick. Rins is just 36 points down on Mir in the World Championship. Nakagami's fifth, by the way. Four races to go. And his last lap was a 49.392, which is right on par with the last lap. After an epic win from 10th on the grid. And look at Lina, who's just tweeted eight winners, eight different winners in the first 10 races of a season in the Premier Class. That has never happened before. He's leading the World Championship. And what about that young man, Alex Marquez, then back to back podiums, one in the wet in Le Mans last weekend. Bins. Is your race winner. Olivier Vial, the Michelin Vice President, hands over the Pilar Molinero, Councillor of Motorland, hands over a second MotoGP trophy to 24-year-old Alex Marquez. That's a 50th podium prize to Alex Rins. This is...